Well, early this morning, we kicked off our Thursday with a little bit of sunshine. Some cloud cover is still overhead as very comfortable conditions will settle in for the remainder of our day today. As of right now, 74 degrees in Rockford. You could see a little bit of cloud cover overhead, but still seeing peaks of that sunshine. Your dew points have dropped in the mid 50s. That's exactly where we want them. Very dry air has moved in and it will stick with us through the rest of our week today. As we stay dry, we still have some flood warnings on the table. As of right now, a countywide flood warning is still in effect for Stevenson County, although it will be dropped at 6 p.m. later today. And we still got some flood warnings for the Pecatonica River in both Stevenson and Winnebago County. Breaking those down just a little bit, that flood warning in Stevenson County is going to expire as we head into Saturday. In terms of the river, in in Winnebago County, a little bit closer to places like Sherlin. It will crest early on Saturday morning. That warning doesn't expire until Monday afternoon. And that again, countywide warning for Stevenson County will expire later today. So seeing a little bit of improvement, even with our drought monitor updated today. Of course, we got lots of rain heading into Monday and most of us not even seeing any of those dry conditions anymore. Just into southern Wisconsin as we did see that improvement thanks to that rain that did end up come on Monday. But moving forward, we are still going to stay dry. That six to 10 day outlook taking us through the middle of August does favor most of our area to stay below average when it comes to that precipitation. And in fact, we do have very little chances for rain as we move forward into the next coming week. Now, speaking of dry, we do want to dry, of course, for that Boone County Fair. Absolutely gorgeous weather for the rest of your day today. Your temperatures will still climb into the middle to upper 70s. Some of us are going to get real close to those 80s as we see lots of sunshine taking over. That cloud cover will slowly start to move out as we stay dry even into tonight. So 80 degrees for that forecast high. Seeing a couple clouds still left over from the early morning hours will slowly start to turn sunny as we head into the rest of our afternoon. Your wind's even going to stay calm. Absolutely gorgeous weather just the way I like it as we head into the end of summer and your temperatures tonight will end up dropping into the mid 50s. So a little bit cooler heading into tonight. Really good night to even crack open some windows as we stay mostly clear and quiet into tomorrow. Even cooler. Your temperatures will only climb into the mid 70s. Dew point's going to stay within the mid 50s, so still going to stay very comfortable. A little less sunshine into the end of our week, but we still get a little chance for that into your Saturday. Low chances for rain also arrive. Very isolated showers may bubble up into the afternoon and overnight hours, but our temperatures will climb into the mid 80s. And in your most accurate 10 day forecast, We'll be a little bit warmer and we'll feel a touch of humidity return throughout the weekend, but then we'll drop off into the low 80s and upper 70s for most of next week. And like I said, little to no rain chances moving forward. Looks like we'll have to wait until the next next weekend for that to come up. Cassandra.